Hi, this is Steven from Vertical.com, and uh, what we have today is an unboxing for the uh, Fallout 4 Limited Edition Loot Crate. So, Loot Crate box is a big box, and it's a Fallout 4 Limited Edition. Uh, this was uh, quite the uh, treasured commodity uh, earlier in the year, and then they came out with uh, another version that I was able to uh, get in and uh, get it delivered. It only showed up to my parents' house uh, a few days ago, so we'll see. Uh, I, we did actually un unbox it yesterday during Christmas, so this is a re-unboxing. What we have inside, the first item we have, uh, and I will say that this is probably one of the coolest loot boxes that's been out there, uh, uh, probably second to the Doctor Who. So the first item is a large flag, and this is a really large flag, here it is. And I think I might have it upside down, yeah. There we go. It's the Brotherhood of Steel flag. So if you've played the game, you've met the Brotherhood of Steel. I'm in the middle of the game, but I've only just started recently and I've not met the Brotherhood of Steel, so I look forward to that part of the game. So a big flag that you can hang. The next one is one of the coolest items, for real. It is a stuffed animal and it's dog meat. If you've seen the uh, advertisements for the game, you've seen the, uh, the individual, the lone wanderer uh, wandering around with dog meat. Uh, and it's really cool, and he's even got little uh, little glasses that protect his eyes from the sand and dust. It's totally cool to me. So, very cool. My girls went right for him. All right, and the next item is also extremely cool. It is a hoodie, and it's a hoodie that looks like the vault outfit. Here it is, right here. It's the standard uh, blue and yellow. Here's the hoodie part, and then, of course, on the back, you have... 111, which is the vault you start out with in this particular game, and you've got it on the chest here as well. Very nice piece, uh, good for all your geekness as you wander around. The next item, continuing the vault theme, is a bag. It's a nice bag, actually, it's a large bag. Blue and yellow with the 111 on the outside, and you flip it open, and it's basically like a large open carry computer bag. It's got some nice uh, little pen pencils right here, and then an open uh, cavity in there, and then there's a small uh, zipper pocket on the front. Pretty cool. The next item is it's a small item right here. What it is is it's a coaster set, and I'll unbox it here because it's not the same coaster. It's four different coasters. So you've got four different coasters. They're kind of a rubber, plastic kind of material, and you've got Baltic Industries. You've got the Nuka Cola Girl, you've got the classic 111, and you've got the classic Vault Boiler. Alright. And let's see what else we got. Well, the next one is a collector pin set. And it's actually cool. It's not just a pin, they give you multiple pins, and there's four pins in here. And I won't take them all out, but they're the standard metal pins with the uh, rubber uh, backing. And they've got various logos in here. So here's the Brotherhood of Steel, the 111, the uh, gasoline diesel fusion, uh, fusion pin, which is the Red Rocket. <coughs> so that's one of the first stations that, that you go to, and of course, the classic Fallout symbol. And let's see, two last items. One, of course, is the standard uh, card that they produce that talks to you all about the individual items. So that's cool to help you remember, especially if you're not as familiar with Fallout. And then finally, you've got a couple of posters, little mini posters, and they're pretty cool. One is sort of a classic Nuka, Nuka Cola girl right there, next to the uh, Nuka Cola. It's a big item in all the Fallout games, of course. Nuka Cola is. And then you have this one, which is the power armor picture inside a uh, inside kind of a garage. It's kind of that classic Fallout uh, imagery from a lot of the advertisements for this particular game. And in fact, it looks a lot like the loading screen. It's pretty cool. So that's a pretty neat item. That's it. Uh, a really nice crate, I think, um, for this particular uh, limited edition crate. Uh, like I said, I think it's been one of the better ones. It's really outstanding. Of course, I guess one final thing, in a loot crate sense, you unfold the box, and what it's going to do is unfold into a Nuka-Cola uh, machine which is really cool unto itself. That's it. Hope you all have a uh, happy holidays and a Merry Christmas. And uh, thank you again for watching from uh, Pretty Cool.